The officials are ready. The fighters are in the ring. And they are ready. So for the thousands in attendance and the millions watching around the world. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble! Alright guys, well let's get right into it. Kim Clavel, 17 wins, 2 losses, 3 by way of knockout, suffered the second defeat of her career on Saturday night, but she's convinced that the judges got it wrong in her title fight with IBF WBO light flyweight world champion Evelyn Bermudez, 19 wins, 1 loss, 1 draw, 6 by way of knockout, who walked away with both belts by way of a 10 round split decision. Yvonne Michelle, who promotes Clavel, lashed out at Judge Benoit Russell, who scored 96-94 in favor of Bermudez, as did Frank Labardi of Chicago. Bill Lurch of Connecticut handed 98-92 card to Clavel, open quote. Kim boxed responsibly and defensively, insisted Michelle to the Montreal Journal. She landed more often. She controlled the action. On the other hand, Bermudez and her team were discouraged after the fight. Kim was smart and brilliant. It's her best career performance, and for me, she's the best boxer in the division. She's just not a champion, close quote. Lavelle plans to march forward to secure another world title fight, open quote. I already had a boyfriend who cheated on me, and it hurt less than it does now, Clavel told Montreal Journal, open quote. In the corner, when I finished the 10th round, I felt like I had it. I didn't have any injuries. I was in control the whole time. She sometimes finished the round strong, but you don't win a whole round in the last 10 seconds. It's definitely not over. I'm world class. I'm a world champion. I'm able to unify the titles. I have not plateaued. I'm not taking anything away from Bermudez, but I have more tools and I'm more strategic than her. I'm angry and disappointed, but I'm so proud of my performance. It was my 19th fight and I think it was my most strategic. Close quote. This is the second defeat in a world champion fight for Clavel, who also lost a decision against Yeska Neri Plata last January in a duel where the WBA and WBC world titles were at stake. Open quote. I might have had a rematch with Plata and a chance to unify the four belts, but all that is delayed because of this decision, close quote, Clavel said. All right, guys, well, what did you think about the fight, uh, Clavel versus Bermudez this past weekend? We might have to watch it back over again, but we did think that she controlled the fight. 98-92 to Clavel, and then the other scorecards were so close, 96-94. Makes you wonder, it makes you wonder, were these judges watching the same fight? How can, a, how, how can scorecards be so different, leaning two separate ways? But hey, that's boxing. The decision is there. Uh, we don't know what's next for Kim Clavel, but if enough noise is made, I'm sure she will get a rematch on this fight. Let us know in the comments below, guys, what you guys think. Do you think Kim Clavel won the fight this weekend? If you do, let us know in the comments below. If you don't, still let us know in the comments below. Uh, you can find us on Instagram at Sportbox TV Official, X formerly known as Twitter at Sportbox TV. And of course, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and also share the vid. We appreciate all love and support. Take care.